She doesn't appear to be wounded. This would explain the carving from earlier. Yes, because the first thing I would do if I was stranded on a desolate island would be to go to the nearest cliff, find a sharp rock, and waste roughly four hours of my life. <sighs> Shut it. What are you doing here anyway? I thought you wanted to explore. And that's exactly what I'm doing. There's simply something extraordinary about roaming the wilds. The wind touching the grass, the birds singing in the trees, and the chilling echo of a dark cave. Just listen to this marvelous noise! That did not just happen. This was not supposed to happen. Get us out of here, Alatheus! Oh, all right. Let me just remove this mountain of rocks and boulders. Would you like Silvermoon wine with that as well? Come on, get a move on. What the... Oh well, looks like you guys will be staying with your friends after all. Time to get yourself out of this mess. We haven't been able to catch anything in four hours. We should just grill the pig. If you even so much as touch our snout, I'll pierce a spear through your flicking ass and hang you over that campfire, lad. This whole hostage situation has turned awfully confusing. Wait, Tom, we've kidnapped these poor folks? Actually, it's the other way around. Oh, so you're the ones that want us to go to this estate. Yeah, yeah. These losers are going to show us the land, and we'll loot it right in front of them. You do realize that we outnumber you four to one, right? Make that five. Who the fell is that dude? Tom, the fate of my estate hangs in the balance. Although I am grateful that you venture far and wide on my behalf, I must ask that you make haste. Otherwise, I may need someone else to complete my quest. No, seriously! What the hell is this? Did I drink too much brew in Lakeshire or something? Anyone else seeing this? I am traveling as fast as I can, Uncle. Your estate will be cleansed. I promise. Good. We shall speak again soon, nephew. Show up. Where are we?
We... Where... Where's Angerian? Calm down. We're not going to hurt you. I am, however, going to hurt Alethaeus if he doesn't get us out of here soon. So we're stuck in here, huh? Who's that Alethaeus of yours? A high elf with no brain. He's off to find something to get us out of here with. What? Oh no, no, no! Angerian's gonna catch him! He's not gonna make it. I'm inclined to agree. Aww, don't be like that, girls. I'm sure Alethaeus will think of something. This is rather bizarre. <coughs> you slimy bastard! <coughs> That might prove to be useful. And then, you lock it just like that. You never told us why you follow Manabink around. Well, it's obviously not for the company, I can tell you that much. And <laughs> definitely not for the money either. So, what is it? I don't know, to be honest. I suppose the old mercenary life got dull eventually. Manabink's a weird, creepy, Floating little prick, but he knows how to pique my interest. Why did he even reach out for you in the first place? Roderick, if you could be so kind. Do you care to clean this? It is too much for me to bear all this... death. Wait, what? That's why you hired me? Manubink needed me to help clean up a mess he'd made. When he left, I eventually had to track him down. Little bastard forgot to pay me. Fast forward a few months and I suppose we're still sticking together. Could you have been any more vague? I'm sorry, bud. If you want the details, ask your pal yourself. I'm no snitch. Hurry, hide! Oh, fuck! Motherfucking fuck! Oh, damn you all to hell! Piece of shit! Oh, fuck! An intellectual, it seems. Fuck's sake. Ugh. Oh, look who's back from the dead. What happened? You were outsmarted by two big green pricks. That's what happened. This is the second fucking time I get trapped in a damn cave! Tough luck, kid. Wait, I remember you. You and Gilneas, when I commissioned a sword for my uncle. Damn right, son. Would've returned it as well if it weren't for the spooky shit going on in this house. Wait, you went to the estate? Guys, shh! Someone's coming. Salutations, gentlemen! I hope your arrival wasn't too rough on your old bones. I'm so fucking done with gnomes. Greetings, Kelderai. What brings your kind to an island such as this? What? Who are you? You better leave if you want to keep your pretty little face intact. You're speaking to a ranger. I'd like to see you try, old man. What the fuck is going on? Your wish shall be granted, High Elf. Who are you, and why have you taken us here? Probably to make us as bitches, judging from that outfit. Silence! My scouts have been following your expedition for quite some time, Paladin. And I know that your precious little team has now adopted my brother, Madam Pink! Alright, that is it. I'm done with these motherfucking gnomes on this motherfucking quest. 
I'm walking out right now, and if you want to try and stop me, be my guest, you filthy small piece of shit. Oh my god! Great, that's gonna stink in a few minutes. Oh, this is no ordinary kidnapping, gentlemen. <laughs> Today, you are in the presence of a gnome unlike any other. Today, you will face true terror and torment by the hands of the one and only Flint Fellspark! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>